airport and I'm so excited about it because me and mom have been planning this little holiday for about was it like two months ago that we actually booked it I think it was wasn't it mm -hmm. so it hasn't been like months in the making but I've been so excited about it because we're going to Mallorca for five days four nights five, four nights four nights, nights. Um, and we're flying from Gatwick Airport. It's gonna be so nice to get some sunshine. And also, Mum hasn't been on holiday since like before COVID, like 2018, 2019, 2019, 2019. So it's gonna be so nice for Mum to get away. We've been hearing so much about like there being so many delays at security and everything like that. So we're gonna see what it's like. But to be fair, when we went to Paris, which was from Gatwick a few weeks ago, that was fine. But that was like a Saturday evening, so I don't know if it's. Yeah, we'll see when we get there, but we've got plenty of time to get there, so lots we should of, be good. Lots of coffee. Yeah, me and mum love a nice coffee. So, me and mum have just arrived at Gatwick. We've made good time, so it's currently 10.40 and we don't actually take off till 2 o'clock, so we've got so much time to like make it into the airport and get through security and everything like that. We also need to sort out our bags because I've can't fit everything into my little like hand luggage that we take onto the plane so we need to sort out that now and hopefully we should be good we're currently on our way to the gate we went through security so quickly it literally took us like 10 15 minutes so that was all good then we just chilled out had some food and we're gonna go board the plane now. I'm just excited to get there, get to Mallorca, and start our holiday. <laughs> I literally slept the whole flight, so it went so quick for me. Mum was reading a newspaper like an old person. I did. <laughs> I did Sudoku. <laughs> so yeah, the flight was so good, like just so quick. I love like a quick two and a half hour flight. It's so easy, so quick. So we're now gonna go get our luggage and then hopefully find our taxi. We were delayed for like an hour in the end, wasn't it? But because the flight's so short, it's actually not too bad. So I hope our taxi man is still coming. Yeah, I hope our taxi's still there. I always get a little bit paranoid when we like pre-book a taxi, so we'll see. So guys, we have just arrived at the hotel and it is so nice. So it's basically like a newly built hotel that opened in April, so at the start of April. It's been joined onto like an older hotel, so there's like a family hotel, which is like the old part of the hotel, and they built this whole brand new adults only bit, which is where me and mum are, and it is so nice. Just walking in the entrance of the adults only bit was just stunning, I'll have to show you in a second, but I'll give you a little room tour of what the room's looking like, and it is, it's so beautiful. I don't think I've stayed in a room that's like this modern and like nice before. It's really nice. So starting off at the door, as you come in, you have this beautiful bathroom. Like how gorgeous is this? And the shower is so nice. Like I literally just want the shower in my house. It's actually stunning. I also absolutely love like the wooden beams. So nice. And then inside here is the toilet, which is a very nice one. Everything's like so clean and obviously new because it's a brand new hotel. Then coming out here, I think we've got, is this wardrobe space? Um, that's robes for the spa. Ooh, very nice. Got a safe there. And then here, oh, this is wardrobe. Oh, we've got quite a lot of wardrobe. Have we got many hangers? Oh, we've got a few. Towels, Towels for, for the, the pool. pool. Very nice. It's also like nice and new. I don't, 
I haven't stayed in a hotel this new, I don't think, have you? No, no. Never. Don't forget the panel here. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. So this is how you turn the lights on and off. It is just like <laughs> the coolest thing I've ever seen. Oh, I've just turned them all off. There we go. Is that back on? Does that end that to individual Yeah, so lights, you can turn everything on. And then air aircon here. This stunning full length mirror. And then coming over to the bedroom area. Is this just not so beautiful? Like I even just love the like fan on the ceiling. And the, the hanging bedside lamps just are my favourite sort of thing. Like I've always wanted something like this in my house. Just like hanging lights from the ceiling. I just think it looks absolutely stunning. And I just love the wood decor. And the bed is a good size. So me and mum sharing this should be all good. And then obviously you've got TV and all our stuff just here. And then got a little coffee station. And then is this the fridge? How do we get into it? Is it a little, oh, a little push. It's got some, is there anything in there? Have you seen? Oh, <laughs> there we go. I think the balcony is like my favorite balcony we've had like at a hotel. It is massive. Let's just, oh, how do I get out? Oh, there we go. It's huge. Like, I actually can't get over how big the balcony is. Love these chairs as well. They're so nice. But yeah, like, mum, stand in the corner so I can just show how, like, just to give you an idea of size, like, this is, mum's just all the way over there. It's actually massive. <laughs> Thanks for the demonstration. <laughs> and then this is the view. So we've got a nice pool view. So that is the adults only pool. Um, the only thing that I don't like is the fact that they haven't like unfolded the palm trees yet. They're all just like clustered up, but. I have to leave them until they get rooted. Oh really? Or something like that. I don't know, but um, they're all brand new, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. So there's some reason. And then over here is the swim up pools, which actually look, look really nice if that's your sort of thing. It's definitely not mine and mum's thing. I prefer like a balcony. But yeah, so this is the view. So me and mum are just heading out to go find some food because the buffet restaurant shuts in like less than an hour. So we're gonna go have a look, but I'll show you the decor quickly because it is so lovely. <laughs> So it is now the next day, me and mum are just getting ready to go down for breakfast. I slept so well in the bed last night, it was actually the comfiest bed. The pillows were a little bit strange because of weird shapes, like this one. This one's just like the longest pillow I think I've ever slept on. <laughs> Look how puffy it is as well. Yeah, like the pillows are just so <laughs> puffy. <laughs> Um, but I slept well, mum didn't sleep as well, but um, I think I was just so overtired yesterday from like getting up early and like not going to sleep and everything like that. Also, dinner last night was really nice. There wasn't like tons of selection, was there? But it was like... No, no it's nice though, but with buffet I find that you end up with sort of mixing everything together so yeah. it starts to taste the same. So You don't have like a proper meal, it's just like random mm. sort of stuff, isn't it? So we're going to see what breakfast is like. Um, and then it's a little bit cold and like windy today. Like it's... Really? It's like a little bit clouded over, which we weren't really expecting for like end of May, start of June. I was expecting it to be, well to be fair, for the rest of the days we're here, it says it's like 25 degrees, 26 degrees, 27 degrees and sunny. So hopefully. Day one today. Isn't yeah, so it is a little bit of like a chillier day. So we're thinking maybe going to the spa or like having a little walk around the like town that's near us. So we'll see what it's like, but I need to get ready to go out for breakfast and the cleaners are next door, so they might come in in a second. So. We're gonna head out. This is my bikini that I'm wearing today, and this is my new one from ASOS. And I love it, like it's so pretty, the print. I never used to like animal print that much, but I actually really like this one. So it's what I'm wearing. breakfast and it was actually really nice there was so much variety you could make yourself like a full english breakfast there was um cereals fruit literally pastries um everything you could kind of want for breakfast that was really good i wasn't like feeling too hungry this morning though so i didn't want to like fill myself up because i think i was just like woke up a little bit tired yeah i didn't want to eat tons this morning but there's so many like snack restaurants and like there's also a coffee shop which i'm so excited about so yeah i'm sure we'll eat lots more food as well today so this is what it's looking like there's not many people by the pool or anything because it is a little bit gray and cloudy but hopefully it clears up this afternoon 
So me and mum are thinking this morning we're gonna go to the spa because we wanted to do that at some point and we may as well do it on a day where it's like cloudy and a little bit gray. So it's not actually freezing though, it's just like a little bit windy. And also one of the other cool things in this hotel is that you can hire bikes which you can ride around. So we're thinking of doing that later on as well. Um, mum hasn't rode a bike for literally ages, have you? So mum's a little bit scared of it. 30 years. Oh my God. So we'll see how mum gets on. We're thinking of doing that later on, but we're gonna head to the spa, check that out and yeah chill out for a bit so me and mom have been to the spa and we didn't really rate it that much did we so it's basically part of the old hotel and it just oh we haven't pressed the button oh. <laughs> yeah <Woo>. <laughs> <laughs> i got scared then trapped in the lift yeah it's basically part of the old hotel so it's just a little bit old so we ended up going back getting changed we're going to go to the little coffee shop and maybe get on the bikes look how nice it looks in the background like the hotel is actually really beautiful yeah. isn't it yeah, no yeah. drinking some strawberry daiquiris mm. very nice Thanks. mum's reading a book. a book that tastes so good though they're very, very nice, nice. Aren't they? We're not in... too strong and nice and sweet yeah we're in there like adults only like lobby kind of bit we just went to the coffee shop but the coffee wasn't particularly nice was it we were just a bit like mm. we'll come get a cocktail instead mm. <laughs> we're gonna go have a little walk just outside the hotel see what's about um and it's actually warming up quite a lot now though. It's like mm, not as windy better, yeah. than it was earlier. So fingers crossed for tomorrow, we can just lay by the pool and chill out. Um, so I'm excited for that. But yeah, we thought we'd do a little bit of an exploring yeah. now. Um, Cause I haven't really, I I remember coming to New York when I was younger, but I, I don't remember it at all. So yeah. it's years ago that we actually came here. So it'd be nice to see. I've just come back to the room and we've had such a nice afternoon just having a little wander around and having a cocktail I literally love the taste of that mojito I just had like it was unbelievable my go-to favorite cocktail has to be a mojito it's just just nothing beats it for me it just tastes so refreshing and nice I've left mum downstairs and she's just finishing off her drink and I'm gonna go for a gym session which I don't think it's a very good idea seeing I just drank a cocktail but you know we're on holiday so I'm gonna go check out the gym I prob I'm probably not gonna do like a proper workout but I thought I wanna do a workout at some point on this holiday so whilst it's a little bit grey outside I may as well go and try the gym we also tried to hire the bikes but they were all taken which is a little bit annoying so we ended up just like obviously walking which actually was really nice because we are so close to like the seafront and the beach and everything like that so we're actually so the hotel we're staying at is called pro tour biomar grand hotel and spa i'm pretty sure that's what it's called i think it's a tui blue or a tui sensatory hotel but i will leave it linked in the description box in case you're interested but so far I am obsessed with the hotel, like this adults only bit with the decor, the room, the like downstairs bit where you can get cocktails, like all the cocktails are so delicious, the food is really nice, like I'm just honestly having the best time. The spa earlier, like I said, wasn't like my favourite, like it was a bit dated and old. This part of the hotel we're in is just so nice, so yeah, really loving it so far, just really hoping we can get out and get in the pool tomorrow, I feel like that's just going to make our holiday even better, so yeah, but me and mum are literally just having the best time, so I've just got into my gym clothes, I'll show you what I'm wearing. I'm just wearing this Gymshark sports bra and then these navigation shorts. Like I actually love the back of them. They're really nice. So they're super comfortable as well. So that is my gym outfit. We'll go check out the gym and see if it's worth it. I don't know. It's in the spa building. I feel like it might be a bit of an old gym. It's so weird like the contrast between this part of the hotel which is so modern, nice and new and then the older part. It's a little bit dated but we will see. Mum's just come back with our cocktail. <laughs> I 
You know that I can't seem to focus when you're getting close to me. We're like a broken. We have just got ready for the evening, so we're gonna head down, get some food, and get some drinks in a second. I went to the gym, and the gym was so empty and like really quiet. And there was actually quite a lot of equipment in there because some hotel gyms I've been to, like you just go in there and there's like hardly anything to use. All the equipment is really old and like rusty. Um, but that one was actually surprisingly really good. So I really enjoyed that, and it was good to just get like a little workout in. I mean, I probably won't work out the next couple of days, but I do actually really enjoy like trying different gyms and things like that. So yeah, me and mum just got ready so i'll show you our outfits um we're gonna go do you think we'll go dinner first and then yeah because dinner opens in like five minutes so we'll get there nice and early hopefully get a table quick this is my outfit so i'm just wearing this long it's kind of like a midi dress from boohoo which i actually really like i got mum to sew up the like buttons though because the buttons used to like pop open so it's so much better now it just sits a lot nicer so this is my outfit and then i've just got my sandals on and then mum's got a cute play suit on no, was it jumpsuit? jumpsuit? Jumpsuit on. And we've got matching sandals, so. Or not completely matching, but just sparkly, so. Let's go. Strawberry mojitos and mum's also got a tea, but they are like the nicest drinks ever, aren't they? So good. Are you happy to be in Spain? Si. <laughs> Mum and I are back in the room and we had such a nice evening actually so we went and got dinner which was actually really nice like I cannot fault the food in this hotel like the food is just so good and then we went and had a few cocktails mum loves the strawberry mojitos as well like they're so good so now I'm just gonna take off my makeup get in bed and chill out for the rest of the evening so I hope you guys have enjoyed part one of the Mallorca vlogs there will be part two coming to my channel very soon so hopefully we'll see more of the pool more of the sunshine so yeah make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on that and other than that hope you guys have enjoyed today's video and I'll see you all again very soon bye Why don't you